Box. Hi there. Welcome once again to Late Night Sex Talk with me, Dr. X. Good evening. Good evening, Doctor. How can I help you, mon ami? Well, you see, what it is is that I'm into men. Well, you know, homosexuality doesn't have to be a problem, unless you happen to live in Tehran, or in Mexico, or in a small town, or unless you want to be a top-class professional athlete, or a dad, or... Listen, you don't understand. I'm into men, but... I'm not a man. <clears throat> I'm a grizzly bear, <clears throat> and I'm having a really hard time coming to terms with all this. Yeah, um, well now, it's great when human beings and animals can get along. But here's the thing, you should never ever allow it to go too far. Throughout history, we find evidence of intimate relationships between humans and animals, particularly in rural areas. Oftentimes, the love of a man for an animal has been frowned upon by society due to its unconventionality and because it leaves you covered in hair. But it's not a bad thing. It's not a bad thing as long as there's informed consent from both partners and the happy couple have been dewormed. Go on, talk to him. Don't be shy. Thank you, Doctor. I feel so much more confident now. I'm going to talk to the man I love and tell him how I feel. Hey, you! yoo huh? Just a second, Doctor. He's waving at me. It's him. Hey, baby! Why are you looking at me like that? What are you doing with that shirt? Oh, wow. <laughs> I got him! I got him! Uh, we appear to have lost the connection. And I guess we've also lost a bear. Oh, well. Enjoy your sex. 